Hello guys, my name is James Contrast and in this video I'm gonna show you how to use the dwell control to enhance your workflow on the iPad Pro. So first of all I'd like to demonstrate to you how I have set it up right now. So in the top left corner I set it to the app switcher. On the top right corner it is set to volume up, on the bottom right to volume down and on the bottom left it is set to taking a screenshot as you can see right now. In order to set the throttle control up you need to go to the settings, go to accessibility touch and make sure that the assistive touch function is on. Then you go all the way down to dwell control, make sure that it is set to on as well and set the feedback action to pause dwell because otherwise it will perform a tap every time you leave the mouse pointer still. And now to the most important part of the process where you set the hot corners and also the seconds in which the selected dwell action will be performed by the system. So if you tap on hot corners you can choose between top left, top right, bottom left and bottom right. And as you tap on one of those you can change the certain action that is actually performed those and as you can see there are quite a few options here and you could even use your own Siri shortcuts here. And you could check out a video about Siri shortcuts are made in the top right corner right now. Now back to the topic. Let's change the hot corner to the control center and see if it already works. Yeah, here we go. And changing back to the app switcher. Let's see, yeah, back to that. Now there is one feature we need to discuss right now and that is the seconds that can be determined right here, especially in increments of a quarter to a second. So it can be set between a quarter second and eight seconds. And determines the amount of time it takes for the trail action to be performed. Now if you do want to use the tap function, just change the fallback action from pause dwell to tap. And to demonstrate this, just leave the cursor still and as you can see, it automatically performs a tap for you. So no clicking needed. Well guys, that's it for the day. Thanks for watching. Please leave a comment down below, hit the like button and subscribe to the channel for more free content like this. And I shall see you guys in the next video.